Hello, my friends. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Miss Ming. On my channel, I do a variety of lifestyle videos and unboxing and haul videos. Today's video is going to be a huge Timu haul. Actually, I placed two orders with Timu and it's actually packed in the same box. So this video is going to be a two-part video, part one and part two. If you didn't know, Timu is an online marketplace. It's kind of like Amazon with different sellers. And the best part is the prices are so much cheaper than the other website. So that's why it's so addicting. I know a lot of you guys follow me because I do a lot of Timu haul in this channel. So also Timu is kind enough to give my viewers a exclusive discount code. I'll link it down below and pop it right here. Without further ado, let's get into these box. And this time, the order really came really, really quickly which is nice and you know sometimes like it takes a little longer sometimes it's like super quick oh my gosh there's so many items guys I oh I am so excited about this I know I've seen these like bottles like colored bottles from Sam's Club and stuff I always wanted to try it but then I was like you know, like save money. But then I saw this on Timu. I was like, let's do it. It's so pretty, guys. It's open. So basically the story is like, um, during pregnancy or after pregnancy when you're breastfeeding, like you should be drinking a lot of water. Like, I feel like even if you're not pregnant, you should be drinking a lot of water. So this bottle makes it easier just because like, look, it gives you like a little mark thing. It's like such a TikTok thing or Instagram thing. Like, so basically it says 7 a.m. rise and shine, drink from top to here. And then 9 a.m. let's get the day started. Um, 11 a.m. remember your goal and drink from to here. 1 p.m. keep it up so by the time it's 1 p.m. you should drink from here all the way here and then 3 p.m. halfway there like so basically it gives you a little like encouragement. I know you shouldn't need encouragement to drink water but I know a lot of people who don't drink a lot of water just like my husband. This one it comes with the straw and you just plug it in. So it comes with a straw. Here we go. And you can drink from the straw and then you close the lid. I guess that's what it is, right? It looks so pretty. So for this item, it says the material is PVC free, hand wash only. Um, so just make sure you don't put it in the dishwasher. And But it is PVC free. PVC free which is pretty good but just like don't put it in a dishwasher but yeah it's so cute Timu is also running a special discount with this item link down below in the description honestly I may actually give it to my husband even though I bought a super girly color but I felt like he doesn't drink enough water during the day all right guys this item seems fancy let's open this one first this is the silicone utensil set with plastic holder um, it's a set of kitchenware it has like utensil organizer silicone kitchen utensil set the box looks pretty fancy um, it can resist them to heat and cold from minus 30 Celsius to 230 Celsius Whoa! really nice every single piece is individually packed guys guys can we take a moment just to appreciate how pretty this is okay it's probably excessive packaging but they basically put they backed everything so this is what oh my gosh this is actually fancy the handle is made of wood and then the actual thing is made with silicon well if it's made with wood it's probably not dishwasher safe because like wooden things are not necessarily dishwasher safe but look how fancy these are hold on let me unbox all of them all right guys first we got a egg beater and then we got a tongue And then we got a little like ladle looking thing. The ladle with the hole. Like this is like, I wouldn't say call it spatula, but like the thing that you flip your stuff, your egg. And this one with the holes. And here is a little spatula. Another spatula looking thing. And something used to brace and coat. 
a real ladle soup spoon, and then this. And then you also get a um, peeler as well. It's a little, it's a little tight, but look! This thing is actually pretty cool. Note that like it's a wooden handle, so probably not dishwasher set. I was thinking about it, I was like, no, it doesn't say dishwasher safe, and I don't think it's going to be dishwasher safe. Um, that's, it's a clothing item, super excited. Because uh, since I was pregnant, a lot of my clothes don't fit anymore. So, but I bought some clothing items from Timu before and I like them. So I hope I like this one. So this is a hoodie item. So it has like a little inner lining, like like this, kind of like a little fuzzy, but it's not as thick I, as I thought. It's actually like a spring type of hoodie thing. I know my clothes don't match and everything, and I have a big belly now. I'm currently 31 weeks pregnant, so let's see. Oh, feels nice. Like. I think it's pretty nice for the price, and then the color is pretty nice. Um, doesn't match the dress, and I also I probably need to lose a little bit weight on this. What size did I get? This is medium. I would say like it is probably true to medium, but most of the times when I buy things from Timu, I do feel like the sizes it, it runs a little small, not like very small, but it runs a little bit small. So if you worry, that I will advise you to get a large. Because I can see some brand have this in small as well. Because the US sizes are a little bit different from China. But I really like the color. So this is like a spring season hoodie. I got this just because I want a gym bag. So I got the tote bag. Let's see. Because like I was like, I could use like a gym bag. Because a lot of times I just use the Lululemon tote bag. But then I was like, Maybe I can get something smaller that fits like a water bottle and like, you know, it's not too big and it's not too small. Oh, actually, I think I recommend this one. Don't you think, like, I think this one is totally good. It's actually better than what I perceive. Do you think this is pretty sturdy canvas quality? I think I like this item a lot and it comes with um, a zipper actually. Which normal tote bags, they got, it doesn't come with a zipper, so you can actually zip it up. So nobody can steal things from you. And it comes with this, and it also comes with a strap, um, which means like if you want like you know a traditional gym bag where you can just put it on or you can go shopping with it, it'll be nice. Actually, this seems pretty cool. You can go grocery shopping with it, you can go to the gym with it. I actually really like it. What do you guys think? <gasps> I think this is actually probably the best item that I got from this haul. Granted that like I haven't unboxed many items, but I definitely like it. There we go. Wow, I like it. If you want to get this one, I highly recommend the black color. I don't remember if they have other colors, but the black color, like I like the contrast between the font and then the actual color. Like I actually like this one a lot. I recommend this item. It, this item is Miss Ming approved. Pretty sturdy, it comes with a strap, it comes with a zipper. Pretty nice. A shoe shelf, I believe. This is a shoe shelf that you can put in your closet or in the bathroom. So you actually have to put it on that you can put. I think it's a really good for a closet space as well. I'm actually assemble it and put it in the closet. And this is what it looks like after you put it on. I have to assemble it and give you guys a look. So this is what it looks like. So um, it's it's, it says it's pretty simple, it's pretty small. As you can tell, like maybe two pairs of shoes per rack. So I think it's also very thin, so it's probably good enough to put into the uh, clothes closet. And honestly, we're not using the closet space, right? A lot of things are just piling like underneath. So I was like, maybe we can just like use the space a little bit more efficient. Hi right, guys, I put up 
the shoe rack so it's actually a very small shoe rack it's just perfect for my closet space so this is our closet downstairs we just use it to um put up like all of our like jackets and stuff so there are some shoes that are new that i bought and i'm just like you know when they're on sale i got them and then i just wear them like when i wash the other shoes so i basically put them in the closet and it's so small the shoe rack is so small that like you know it doesn't affect i can still close the closet door this is how big our closet is and just like fyi um the um pole are actually made with metal but these part are made with um plastics so the side are made with plastic you can see it's very easy to assemble you just basically put the like metal pulls inserted all the way under and this surface is actually like um how do you say this material it's not actually a hardboard or whatever it's actually um very soft surface a paper thing but it actually looks pretty good after you assemble it so basically basically thread the poles through and it just became this like stretched up surface but this is like if you can see it's actually like paper it's actually soft pretty soft and for the look you know i can put the shoe boxes here pretty good and it basically can store two pairs of shoes per rack or you can put it this way i think it's a really good item for your closet instead of like you know for the living room or entryway or whatever because it's compact enough to stick into your closet and you can you know put your shoes on top and you can also buy two of them if you want more because this is like a kind of like small so if you buy two of them it will just you know from here to here and you can store more pairs of shoes like underneath your clothes in the closet so yeah i think it's actually pretty good and it's so easy to assemble because it's made with plastic and the metal pole and the soft surface is not made with like wood or anything you don't need screws or whatever so it's like super super easy you just like stick it in there these are the microfiber towels what do they do they you can use it to clean the kitchen so my husband actually complains that we use too much paper towel to clean the kitchen honestly i agree i do feel like when i use a lot of kitchen towel it's like it's one thing if it's like you know i use it to smudge my face because sometimes my allergies are really bad but it's another thing that like if you clean some water from the counter and then i just use the paper towel i felt like it's bad for the environment because you have to cut down the trees and stuff so my husband was like oh let's save money and then use like not use a lot of paper towel we'll still use the paper towel but like not as much so these are the microfiber towels and what it is it's like it's in this like very absorbent type of material and like you just you put them in the wash machine after you use them like several times so you can use it like to clean the counters and stuff it's very like absorbent and oh this is the hook so what is this is that you put it on your kitchen cabinet doors and you can put the towels on there like you can just hook towels and put other things on there and it just saves space for you know putting on your like kitchen stuff you have you can have different things and these are the hooks for the cabinet door i think it's a really good design to save a lot of space because our drawers and cabinets are getting fuller and fuller uh, as i accumulate more kitchen junk so these are really good for kitchen organization there are different colors of these hooks so remember i got the like metal looking one and these are the black ones comment down below which one you like i bought them as individual or maybe a set but they're packed as a set they're packed individually but this is what they look like so these are the black ones maybe the black ones look better in some household but this one are the like uh, stainless steel look ones i guess this is what it looks like when i put it on so basically these are just like little hooks that you can hook on your kitchen cabinet um preferably under the sink and you can hide it right here and you can hang your kitchen towels or anything you want to hang here it saves a lot of space and it's just so easy when you use the kitchen towels um it's just so easy you just reach under and then you can use it to clean the kitchen countertop which is pretty handy so this is what it looks like when i put them on actually put it actually looks really nice Ta -da! okay i found the toe bag like this is very interesting because I actually have a long shamp bag um, 
and it's like a hundred something dollars from Lam Shem. Um, so I saw this item and I was like, this is kind of like a dupe bag. Let's see. Ta-da! This is what it looks like. It actually looks pretty cool. I got the color of blue. I have a gray one from actual like Long Sham. And this is like a dupe bag where it's foldable. Oh wow. It's actually pretty good. It's definitely different from Long Sham because like, you know, the zipper is different. It doesn't have the Long Sham mark or whatever. It's not like fake Long Sham, but it's kind of like a toe bag that's foldable. <laughs> I think it, like, I think I got medium, like not too big, and I think it's actually pretty good quality. Wait, this is actually pretty cool. It feels pretty sturdy, and then the detailing right here doesn't look bad. Like if you can look closer, it actually doesn't look bad. It does not look bad at all. Oh my gosh! And inside, um, it comes with like a pouch with zippers. It's like a small pouch with zipper, basically like this. And then it comes another like little pouch without the zipper. Um, the inside looks a little bit different from Longchamp. You can tell this is not Longchamp from the inside, but from the outside, it actually looks pretty cool. I think this one looks pretty good. You can kind of tell it's not Longchamp because it's so clear, it doesn't have any logos or anything. But if you just like carry this, I think it's it's hard to tell. The outside looks just like Longchamp. The inside lining, it can, you can tell there's like a little bit of difference in terms of how it's lined. But other than that, I think this is a pretty good purchase. I do I do like this product. I can't tell if I like the toe bag more or this bag more. Maybe the toe bag just because it's so like contrasting like the black on white is just so pretty but this is definitely also a good bag that you can use it to go to work or put your laptop in there this is definitely big enough to get the laptop and it's so lightweighted and it's also foldable as well so yeah i do really like this i have to try this this is a mini sealing machine so it says what it is is like it's a usb charging thing it's used to seal bags like if you use basically according to the website it says like if you eat chips and then like you finish the chips like you don't want the chips to go bad then you can use it to seal it it comes with a charger it's a usb charger and a manual um so the manual is actually bilingual this is english this is chinese <laughs> at first i was like oh no no one's gonna understand this um but i would since i am actually chinese so basically this is a magnet and you can just glue it like not glue it but like adhesively put it on the refrigerator plus is sealing mode the minus is the opening mode so basically this is the button and this is like little like rotation if you go up this is to open mode and this is the ceiling mode what it is is that there's like a little plus right here there's a little minus right here it's like so hard to tell there's a little minus right here and there's a little plus right here uh, we have to use it to seal my chips we have to try this out all right guys now let's try this item so now we're gonna put it on the plus and we're gonna try this out and this side is actually a magnet so you can put it on your fridge oh so you pull it to the side if you have thin backs pull it slower uh, put, pull it faster uh, this way oh. <gasps> It actually worked. There we go. It's actually sealed, guys. It's actually sealed, but it's very easy just to reopen it. And honestly, if you pull it too slow, it will have a hole in the back because I pull it too slow. So we're gonna cut it. So we come over here, put it in, go. All right, it's a little bit hot and it's actually sealed. Ta -da! It's actually sealed pretty nicely. Nice. So you just have to pull it a little bit slow depending on the bags. So thin bags pull it a little bit faster um, so, um, because it, like, it will actually do a hole if you don't. And then the thicker bags, you want to pull it a little bit slower. 
This one's a little bit thin, so you want to pull it really, really fast. Sorry guys, my hands are really slippery right now um, because it's so hot in my house right now and I'm pregnant. <laughs> Okay, I think it's sealed. Let me do the middle part a little bit slower. There we go. Yeah, it actually works. Guys, it actually works. This one you can see very clearly. It was sealed right here. It's pretty nicely sealed. Success! Yeah, my fingers are really, really swollen right now because I'm pregnant. <laughs> So it's a little bit hard for me to like do a lot of handy things, but it actually works out. This thing does get hot, um, so make sure you turn it out after you use it. And then make sure you put it on lock instead of, you know, whatever. So yeah, actually worked. It worked. It sealed it pretty nicely. So how you check is you can see there's some air in the back. And if you press on this air, this air doesn't come out. That means it's actually completely sealed. So if I press on it, like look, it kind of pops off. So you can see this is completely sealed because like, you know, kind of like when you first bought something and then when it's like air sealed, the air doesn't come out of the back. So success. So I actually bought one for myself from Amazon and this is definitely cheaper than Amazon but I, my husband actually took the one that I got. So what it is that you can actually dry scratch your head if you want but uh, what you can do like it's basically like a nice massage. These are not like hard, it won't hurt you. It's just like silicone and when you do like when you wash your hair you can just use it to scrub like um, gently exfoliate your like scalp. It feels really really nice like when you wash your hair with like this like it feels like a deep more of a deep cleanse and also like it's a nice massage to stimulate your um, circulation especially like to stimulate a lot of like you know in your head area so I actually really really liked it my husband took my other one and this one actually like it because the way it grips it's like easier to grip into it so like you can just use it like every time you feel stressed or you feel, feel like you have a headache or migraine but like you can also use it the main use is like when you wash your hair like you can just use it to scrub your hair to get a little bit of exfoliation of your scalp and also like it's a really nice circulation and stimulation of your the hair. next item that i got is also a kitchen towel item i think it's really nice it's also similar to like that microfiber thing it's a little bit like thinner than the microfiber towels but what i love about it is it comes with a little strap so you can actually hang it thinking is i can basically hang these on top of these see how good it looks right so i think it's pretty nice to have my kitchen towels right here um on the cabinet it saves a lot of space so i got a bunch of them and also you can use it to like insulate uh for your pots and stuff and my husband said like he needs a mat for the bathroom and i was like don't worry i got you something for the bathroom i hope it's big enough for his bathroom um this is the this is how big it is so basically instead of getting a mat that's like super how do you say it like very thick and fuzzy this one is um vacuum safe it's what vacuum friendly so if you put it like on top then like if the vacuum can go on top like nicely you can put it in front of your bathtub or you can put it in front of your house or in your entryway it doesn't matter but it's pretty nice and like it's in this like a special material and it's pretty non-slip at the bottom so i think it's easier to clean this one you can easily just wipe it up so you don't have to wash them in the washing machine and things like that so i'm gonna get this one for my husband and i got this kitchen mitt for my husband because he's the one that cooks let's be real <laughs> i I cook too, but like ever since I got pregnant, I just stopped cooking in general. Oh, this is actually really comfortable. This is actually really comfortable. It has like multiple layers. It's pretty thick. Outside is this silicone looking thing and you put your hands in there. Yeah, it feels nice. And also you can easily clean it because it's like, you know, you know, you can just wipe it off so you don't have to like wash it all the time. It's easier to clean the surface of this one. 
I like this one. I got this for my husband as well. Oh. Um, this is also a repurchase item. It's the LED solar torch light light control. I got it in my last haul and it's so nice. I know it's kind of like squeezed a little bit. You do want to be careful sometimes with the packaging because like sometimes when you buy too much, like things do get squeezed a little. Um, it looked really nice in my backyard, in my front yard. So I decided to buy another one. So last time when I did it, I forgot to turn it on. I was like, why is it not working? So basically this is the light head, right? And then you twist it open and then you there is a switch right here it says on or off you have to switch it from off to on and then you put it in your front yard so that is a critical thing I do like the fact that there is a switch so you can if you don't want it to be on then you don't have to be so when you cover the light solar panel it looks like this and it kind of flashes to so make it this like kind of like a like a real flame type of light it looks so pretty in the front yard and it comes with the um the bond soil so basically you put it in here and then you put it in here we got four in the last haul i really liked it so we got more it's so pretty and lights up your pathways and stuff like that like highly recommend this is a definitely a really really nice household item i'll insert a little clip um all right guys we're in the front yard of my right now so i'm gonna stuck it in here or you can find a little bit softer yeah this one is softer softer spot and basically started to absorb all right so we'll just put those two here and then i'll put the rest all right guys so this is what it looks like at night it actually looks pretty cool um it's definitely a smaller size one it actually looks pretty cool i like it it kind of like it's like a warm color resembles the frame the flame all right success all right guys i know what this is this is the wall mounted six cut six hook kitchen organizer basically you hook it in the kitchen cabinet on top of your counter and then once you hook it in if it stays you can put like towels you can like hang your mugs and cups on top so it saves space for your kitchen so i actually got it for my husband's office um they just move into a new office and then like they have like limited like kitchen space for everyone's mugs you know like everyone will have like a coffee mug or whatever at the office so i was like maybe this is a good idea and like maybe they can hand their mugs so everyone's mugs will have a place because like their kitchen cabinets are already full so we will put it into test to see if it actually works um it, of course it depends on the kitchen and like if it works in one kitchen may not work in the other kitchen and i got these storage box i probably got too many of these storage box so basically these are cosmetic storage box where you can put your like bottle of like cosmetic like bottles and stuff like that like your makeup stuff like that your eyeshadow your whatever like in here so it just keeps it like so it's clear you can see what's in there you can see the lipstick and stuff so i have a bunch of makeup stuff and like i feel like they're not well organized so i'm trying to get my life together to get myself organized i bought some of these like organization stuff and hopefully i can cultivate a good habit um, of organizing things and not putting them like everywhere in the counter so yeah it seems like this haul is getting long we have the second part of the video coming up soon so I, i'm gonna end the video here if you like this type of hauls please comment down below and it, your words really encourage me to film more videos like this and comment down below what is your favorite item in today's haul we got so many exciting new items and let us know what's your favorite thing in this haul and what's your favorite thing you got so far from team website and before you go don't forget to like and subscribe and i hope to see you in my next video. Bye!